Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another reaction video for today and uh, I'm watching another El, El Analista de Beats video. This is Xenoblade Chronicles X uh, Wii U versus Switch graphics comparison uh, trailer right here. So, which I was wondering like how much of a graphical leap it is because I haven't, I never really played Xenoblade Chronicles X. I, I played it a little bit, but like not enough to really say I played it. Like I got it. I was ex excited for it because I love Xenoblade Chronicles and there was just something about the first few hours of, of X that just didn't really entice me. And it, it didn't help that it took me. I bought it when it first came out. I remember it was a buy two, get one free sale at Walmart, I want to say, or Target. They're both the same place to me. Um, <laughs> I don't go to them, so they might as well be the same place. Um, but they were having a buy two, get one free sale. Um, and I got that and like a couple other crap games. And uh, I remember just it took me months to even start playing it. And then I started playing it and I only maybe played for a few hours. That was it. So. Yeah, um, I, I, the reason why I was so like not into playing it is because I, I kept hearing like it just isn't as good as the first one, and it just I was like uh, I don't know I had other games to play I remember that and it was just a uh, yeah it was just one of those games where it's just like cool I'm glad it got made I bought it so I supported it and uh, yeah I'm glad it's getting re released though because I would like to give it a whirl but I need to go back and play two and three before I even decide X is a thing I need to play but uh, let's get to it let's check this out let's go uh, three two one play link in description. El Analista de Beats. Okay. Oh, good, good start. All right, just ground texture. Okay. Looks fine for Wii U. Yeah. 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 All right. Definitely. It's different at least. It's it's clear. Yeah, it's better. It's, it definitely is. I mean, it, I'm, I think I'm at the point where like I don't really care about ground textures as much. I don't know. Like, even, like, a month ago, I cared more. But maybe, I don't know, maybe it's just how I feel right now. I used to really care, like, what does the ground look like? Ooh, that's good. That's good-looking ground. Or right, I don't know. Right now, I'm not. I'm, I'm just, like, I don't really care. <laughs> maybe it's because it's a Switch. So I'm not expecting much from, like, textures, especially on the ground. So I'm just like, eh, whatever. I don't care. I saw it. I was like, cool. It's better. I don't, it doesn't fucking matter, really, that much of it. But this, I want to see the character models. That's what matters. Okay. The hair looks... Wait. Oh, okay, because it's a different character. Okay, I get it. Because you make your own character, right? Wait, I want to see that shot. I want to say there's less fog in the Switch version. It has like almost like a foggy look to it. Which actually makes sense if this is set in the same... Actually, I don't know. Is this set in the same world as Xenoblade Chronicles 1 at all? I really don't know. I assume it is. And so it being a little misty and foggy makes sense. Yeah, they, they they made the faces look. You know what's weird? When I saw the trailer, I was like, you know what? It looks it looks a lot like a Xenoblade Chronicles face. But now I think I'm like that looks more like Xenoblade Chronicles 1 face. Like the original release. I think my brain has been like completely um wiped when it comes to the first game well not completely wiped but like i look at that and i think that's a xenoblade chronicles face when technically this was definitely closer to what <laughs> the original faces look like a lot of people complain about the faces in the original i don't remember that it just do they, they didn't have a lot of movement to it like, like everybody's face looked like they had like almost permanent frown when they talk oh it's me it's me shulk i'm british <laughs> I love that they kept that, by the way. Everybody's British. They ne they didn't change that. I mean, the, her costume's brighter. Her hair looks better. The face looks different. It looks more like Xenoblade 2, 3, and Definitive Edition for 1. Looks better. Looks cleaner. Even the background looks better. Oh, there you go. That's a good... That's a really good uh, pause right there. Yeah, the hair just looks more like hair. Besides, like, a Lego piece hair. I mean, it doesn't look that bad. I shouldn't say that. It looked, it looked fine in the Wii U version. For a Wii U, it looked fine. Why? I don't know why this shot reminds me of Bayonetta 2, the beginning when she's, like, going shopping. Right? That's, yeah, that's Bayonetta 2. Bayonetta 3 has a shot like this, or a scene like this, too. She's on a boat, though. Yeah. You know what it really looks like? It looks like it's just, like, a little... Like, the contrast is up a little bit more on the Switch version. There is some different different models, I think, here. Like, the character models are probably different, I would assume. Uh, but that's, like, just 
so it can be closer to the other games in terms of, in terms of uh, characters uh, uniformity uh, character design uniformity uh, whatever cat all right let's see how good the cat looks okay it, it looks better yeah they remodeled that cat look at the face you could tell for sure yeah yeah that's a better that's a better looking cat better looking cat yeah that cat look better mm -hmm. it's crazy that it's crazy that they announced this out of nowhere like this I guess there's no Nintendo Direct coming anytime soon, so they're just like, "Would well, it have been cool if they announced this at like the Game Awards or something?" Though, would have been a nice reveal. Oh, I think the wait, hold on, let me see the water again. I don't know. I want to see that again. Eh, it's about the same kind of reflection. Oh, I, uh, it's, <laughs> Now water, water. I, I always like a good looking body of water. Do Sea of Thieves and what was the game recently? There was another game I saw recently where the water effects look so fucking good. What was it again though? I mean GTA Five still has amazing water effects, like the foaminess on the top of it. But like Sea of Thieves and there was another game recently. I swear that the water looks so fucking good. I can't remember what it was now. Yeah, this guy's buns are a little bit more, uh, <laughs> toned. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, Gore, what? There's gonna be a, there's gonna be a fucking, on, in the comments, there's gonna be one of those tags where you put the, the number of, like, in the, it's like, Gore, what? Um, what? Yo, bro, what? 655? Bro, what? <laughs> Shut up. I actually, I do want to see this. You know, it, that's actually, like, uh, the faces on the Wii U version look like if you mixed the more modern-looking faces in Xenoblade with the ones from the original release of Xenoblade Chronicles on Wii. Like, if you, like, fused them together, like, that looks closer to what we see now. Or, I, that's actually pretty much exactly what we see now. The, that face quality and design-wise, because it, look, it looks different from the original, just, like, in terms of, like design not just quality of graphics and animation i guess you know what i want to say i like the original face better there's something about the original face that looks more unique to me I'm, i'll probably be alone on that one but i also don't know this character so i don't even remember this part i played this part to be fair, it was almost 10 years ago at this point. Well, actually, it might have been a little bit less than that, because I don't think I played it until the year later. But Because then the, this game come out in, like, December or some shit like that. Or, like, November or something. I remember it was at the end of the year, 2015, I think. It wasn't 14, right? It was 15, I'm pretty sure. Um, I mean, that's the best comparison right there, for sure. Like, I mean, that's the... That's... That's the, that is the, I mean, that's why it's the thumbnail. That's night and day <laughs> difference. <laughs> so, almost like a completely different character. I think it's just the lips are like too, like, Botoxy. And I'm talking about for a lot of, a lot of the characters in Xenoblade 1. And they got the frown, they got the big lips and they got, they frown. I can't do it. <laughs> Everybody's like that. Fiora. Yeah, yeah, you can't really. Like, I think. Oh, there, there, no, no, there actually is more detail of, like, more stuff there. I don't know what those are. I didn't even notice that the first time. You see that again? Yeah, there's more detail. Which is actually kind of crazy, considering the Switch always has a hard time with, like, detail in the environments like that. But it's beating the Wii U, at least. But to be fair, the Wii U came out 12 years ago. 
but also the Switch came out what seven years ago, so and it's also portable, like actually portable, not like the Wii U where it's like it's kind of portable. No, really, you can't get fucking two inches away from the thing before you lose a signal. <laughs> Obviously not actually two inches before someone's like, um, no, uh, <laughs> oh yeah, no, this is a big, oh yeah, that looks much better. Yeah, that looks much better. Oh yeah, the water looks better too. In that shot. Yeah, I can tell it's just like way clearer and the, you can tell the textures are better. You know what, this shot, the, the shot, this shot reminds me of, like, it, it looks almost like a Monster Hunter game, almost like an older one on the Wii U or something, like Monster Hunter 3 on Wii U. Yeah, you can tell. It's just like it just looks clearer. Like the other ones you could, but this one is like the better, the best example of it. Yeah. Oh yeah, more detail. Just more detail. More detail on those mountains and rocks. It's just way more. I mean, I think those details are there on the Wii U version. Like if you got closer to them, you would see the same textures. Uh, I would, I would guess. Uh, it's just like the. The draw distance is way worse. It just gets blurrier as you get further away. Even the detail on the little long neck thing with the shit growing out of its head uh, in, in the foreground here. Uh, like you can tell that the textures are a little bit better. A little bit clearer. It, it, even though it's clear as day, it admittedly doesn't really matter in the long run. Because people could play games from 20 years ago and still love them. And they could be as blurry and shitty looking, shitty looking as possible and still be great. So, honestly, it doesn't even matter. Are we seeing this again? Or just, oh, side by side. I get it. I get it. I'm the beat. Yeah, <laughs> I'm the beat. Ooh, nice little space shot here. That looks almost identical. It's a little, the moon thing here looks a little darker in the Switch version, but the, the, the blacks really stand out more on the Switch version. You know, you can see it's like darker, inkier blacks, as they say. And no, I'm not being offensive when I say that. Um, I, yeah, actually, I think the, uh, this might look a little bit better. On the Wii U. Am I the only one that thinks so? I mean, the shot is a little bit different, so maybe it's not fair to really compare them. Yeah, because that was a couple, that was almost a completely, not a completely different shot, but it was definitely, there was an explosion on the Switch version, not on the Wii U version, so I'm assuming it's a different shot. Unless they're changing things up, I guess that is possible. Um, actually, we go. Oh, he's gonna do it now. We'll just wait. I'm jumping the gun. Yeah, oh, there's more stars. I didn't even notice there's way more stars. Look at that. Wow. Oh, yeah. No, actually, yeah, I should have waited. Oh, that's actually good right there. You can see like half of half and half here almost. Yeah, no, it looks better on the Switch. It looks better on the Switch. It actually looks great. Yeah, that's a great shot right there. On Switch. Switch. I like you can see lights in the earth or wherever the fuck this is. <clears throat> Alright, let's see if it looks better. Nah, it looks better on Switch. It just looked for that one shot. Like, even the smoke looked really, like, well, more detailed. Yeah, nah, it, look, it looks better. It looks better on Switch. <laughs> I, I tried to give you credit, with you? Sorry. Alright, there you go. Like, even, even the explosion, you can see it's way more clear on the Switch version. Way more stars in space. There's like an explosion here. That's I guess we probably can't see it. It's probably there. It's just we can't see it right now. Yeah, th this one's not as noticeable from what I saw, but let's see. Let's see. Eventually. Yeah, we switch. Yeah. Let's get a, take this shot. I assume. Oh no, this one. Oh, more motion blur going on. The switch version. Way more motion blur. On Switch. Okay. It's actually blurrier on Switch because it seems like they added motion blur. I guess it was on the Wii U version? Oh, I didn't notice it when it was moving. 
It's one of those things where I don't really notice it. Oh, we go watch the whole trailer now. Yeah, I think it's gonna be the whole trailer. Yeah, these are these are really good comparison videos. I really gotta give it an Alista D beats. Actually, no, I take it back. Six 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 subscribers. I don't I don't fuck with that devil shit. Sorry. Sorry. No, I'm just kidding. Hail Satan. Hail Satan, bro. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Yo, I'm a long leg supporter, bro. Hail Satan. Mwah. Long legs did nothing wrong. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be one of those things where like it looks better here now, but when you're when you're playing it portable, it's gonna look worse, obviously, because they're showing they're not gonna be street like recording this from the portable version. So it's probably actually gonna look closer to the Wii U version when you're playing it portable, maybe even worse. Which is again not gonna even matter because you're not gonna notice it really while you're playing it. As long as it plays well, it doesn't matter. I, I still think they should port the original Xenoblade Chronicles. Just the original one. <laughs> I think that would be really fun if they did. It would be stupid and unnecessary and nobody would want that, but I would want it just for, I don't know, completion's sake, I guess. Oh, bring the 3DS version also. There you go. <laughs> oh, port put those two in one cartridge. Put the original version of Xenoblade Chronicles and the 3DS version and put them together. <laughs> you know? I don't know what that noise was. <laughs> oh, I should have did that Sonic X Generations comparison. I don't know why I never did that. Anyway, these are fun. I always love watching comparison videos. Um, and uh, yeah, no, there definitely is a, a noticeable difference. So that's nice. Anyway, that's it. Bye.